find random miracles lying around where fireflies have gotten stuck under a building. Well, not usually buildings. Oh, there's two under there. Stuck under like three. Seriously, <laughs> stuck under rocks or. That darn critter ain't no bigger than the last time I seen him. Shut up. <sighs> yeah, so you can find miracles stuck under rocks or under fences, under trees, like you just saw there. Uh, yeah. So we need to make our creature bigger. As far as I know, there isn't actually any way to win this mission. Mission? Um, quest? Because the creature doesn't get that much bigger on this level unless you stay it for a long time. In which case it will, I'm guessing, but I've never stayed it long enough for him to be big enough to appease that dude. But there are mushrooms which make him bigger, I'm pretty sure. I think I said this last set. There are mushrooms which make your creature bigger. But I don't know whether there's any more around. I know I've already found one. At least I hope I found one. <laughs> Other that or I just poisoned my creature, but either way. Swap your creature with this one if you want. Shut up. That's really gonna annoy me. Um one of our miracles escaped. It probably had something to do with our creature. You will find. If you're playing this game and your creature just sort of decides to start knocking things over, he'll go for miracles and trees and buildings and just about everything. I once had a creature that really didn't like trees and he just ripped up every single one that he saw, pretty much. Didn't bode well for my village. Ah, outside. Okay, um, I think that's pretty much everything we can do other than that and that. I know there's a way to do this one over here. I need a rock. Giving birth. But she isn't, she's walking. What are you talking about? Game's talking nonsense. Yeah, so we can pick up rocks and just lob them at him until he believes. Do you believe me now? It's my only possession. Leave me alone. Let's kill him anyway. Go on, boss. But you mustn't, please. Uh, what do you give us? Medical to cast. How very thoughtful. Just one. <laughs> you know what I know? If these people are so e easily able to get a hold of miracles. Why exactly do they need a god? He is flying. You see this little, uh, the L percentage? I'm pretty sure that's life. When it hits zero, they're dead. Every single time it hits something, it will go down. Like that. Die. You killed him, you uncaring, horrid, mean god. Yay! Why, if he's dead, why is he still flailing? <laughs> there we go. Okay, so he's dead. Mainly because he was annoying me. Let's give him a burial, let's see. Aren't I a nice person? Okay, so... What are you doing? You're not a disciple. Why are you not a disciple? You're him, aren't you, I think? So you're just... Oh, okay. No one's worshipping my rock! Oh, 
Worship it. It is holy. I touched it. Worship the holy rocks. That's that. I think that's all of the missions we can do at the moment. Mm, other than this one. <laughs> It's not really helped that save just then. I didn't put it on the thing properly. No, that's not here. Ugh. I'll come back to it later. I really cannot be bothered at the moment. Whoa, camera! Come back. There we go. <laughs> swap your creature with this one. Go and chill want. out over there for a while. I am not going to swap it for the cheap because look at him. The most derpy face ever, and his ears like flap inwards. And he has creepy eyebrows. I like my, I like my um, my tiger. He looks cool. By the way, yes, there is a reason why I'm putting them here. But if you've played the game, you know why. And it is through sheer laziness. <laughs> Later on, at least. Oh, yeah, there's the trees I threw. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> um, where's my preacher? No, he's you're hungry. Can't you feed yourself? Are there any pigs around? Ah, there's one. Come here and have a snack. And we've got a mission to go and do. Eat it. Eat. Or lie down and have a nap. Get up. Come here. Eat. <laughs> Looking a little bit tubby. <laughs> Eat it. Or else. Good boy. There you go. Now you're all good. Go rest up in your pen for a little while. Oh. <sighs> okay. Start this one. Howling the gold on story scroll. Creature in the valley beyond. We're all terrified! This must be the creature that Siebel spoke of. Let's investigate. You think? How many huge creatures do you think there are? <laughs> okay, so we can go and see this huge creature, which no one Look noticed at the before. the size of that! Ah, okay, we're dead. We're all dead. What is it? Where's it from? It doesn't seem to be aggressive, though. If it is, we're all dead. Even the spirits. Dead, you two boys. Can you hear that? This giant is communicating. It's telepathic. You have a creature. Bring him to it's me. It's telepathetic. No way. He'll eat it. Wait, that's good idea. This giant looks friendly. My thoughts exactly. Let's bring our creature. Please use the leash to bring your creature to me. Fine. Be back in a minute. Hey, Dim. Okay. Yeah, come on. Don't start pooing on my temple. That's the wrong bit. Go down this way. <laughs> Did 
do do do. Come on. You're so puny compared to him. <laughs> You're like the size of his toe. Yes. Use the leaf to bring your creature to me. Come on. Here we go. I do now make friends these and be happy. He is looking a bit tubby. That might be muscle one. I don't know. <laughs> We're going. I'll show you the creature cave after this. Another creature? Is it true? Are you real? I've been alone for eons. I thought I would die without ever seeing another god. Or another creature. I once belonged to Nemesis, the most powerful of gods. But his power kept growing, and soon I wasn't bold enough for him. So I was cast out, banished here, and I've been alone ever since. Until now. This being is astonishing, but what a sad tale. In return for your friendship and that of your creature, I will teach you both. You will both learn well, isn't the that nice? of the gods. When you are ready for the first lesson, meet me at the village through this pass. We'll do. First of all, we're going to go and... We'll go through there in a minute. Our creature's just automatically following him. Uh, but first of all, I want to go in here to that room there, the orange one. Come on, creature cave. The creature cave. The squirrels display different attributes about your creature. So this is going to tell us all you want to know about our creature. And here he is down here. We want to tattoo him. I might put a tattoo on him in a minute. Okay, so this the actions he's learned. What he's learned to do. Fill his brain with evil. So he doesn't know how to do very much at the moment. He knows how to take food from the field, and he knows how to fish. But we need to teach him how to do this one. I won't double click on it because it breaks it. Um, we need to teach him how to do this one, the village store. I don't really want him to learn how to use the totem because he will do it constantly and break everything I do. Um, so we want to teach him how to dance as well because that would be cool. This Isn't only miracles, miracle as you can see from the tiny little list. Mainly because I haven't even used any miracles yet. This shows I think. Oh, that's mine. His likes and dislikes. So this is going to show all of the stuff. What he thinks. So he's quite greedy, he's not at all tired, he's not at all frightened, he's quite playful. So, all in all, he's quite a happy creature. Um, he thinks I should pay him more attention. <laughs> uh, he knows about one temple, he knows about one creature, he knows about eight flocks, and he knows about three forests. More general information such as his age and height, bless him. Hey boys, you can ch So at the moment, his name is actually my name, which is a bit weird. But he's zero years old because he's only a baby. Uh, he's got 100% health. He's on side good. His strength's at 54%, but he's quite fat. We need to get him to work a little bit more. Um, he's very hot. Completely healthy. He's got 60% poo. Which, yeah. And he hasn't fought any creatures. So he hasn't eaten any mushrooms, but I swear I gave him one. I've been imagining things. Uh, we're gonna tattoo him now. 